All right, we're just days away from the official start of the Bengals season. The team will celebrate its new stadium name today. WCPO 90s reporter Madeline Audley joins us live outside Paycor Stadium. What are they doing this morning, Madeline? Hey, Adrian, good morning to you. Yeah, the Bengals rolling full steam ahead with this new name. And if you ever forget it, the good news, I mean, hey, you just have to look up. You can see that big sign that crews have been working hard to get finished ahead of the team's first game this weekend. Uh, today, the Bengals will hold a ceremony to officially cut the ribbon on Paycor Stadium. That is happening at 3 o'clock. Important to note, though, the city and county still need to give formal approval for the new name and the stadium's new signs. The city is holding a public hearing for those new signs next week. Fans, meanwhile, are gearing up for the first game. Bengal Jim is expecting about 1,500 people at his tailgate Sunday. He's got three local restaurants coming in, and he's planning to raise money for charity. This year, he expects the Bengals will pick things up right where they left off after last season's Super Bowl run. I've never hugged uh, so many strangers. and never cried so much in my life last year. It was, it was just an amazing run. And I got a feeling this is going to be a run for us for the next 10 to 12 years. That's, that's, that's this team's built young team with a dynamic quarterback with the organization behind them. It's, it's going to be a fun run. Now the Bengals will kick off their season here at home on Sunday against the Pittsburgh Steelers starting at one o'clock. Uh, we know a lot of fans are going to get the party started earlier than that. Bengal Jim tells me he plans to be out here starting at seven o'clock in the morning on Sunday for now live at the banks. Madeline Ottilie WCPO 9 News.